Sean Webb here with another Gears 3D Golf Motion Analysis of a PGA Tour player from this face-on view. And today we're going to talk about the motion of the hand path or the movement of the grip of the club um, during the downswing and how that affects the outward movement of the club. So what I mean by that is, let's take this tour player up to the top of the swing. I think the misconception that most people have is that from here, at this point, the player should take the hands and pull them straight toward the ball. And that's what I get a lot of students coming to the studio. They think that the more they pull this grip and make a sharp line straight to the ball, the more they'll be able to retain lag and create club head speed. Um, and that's not true. The, the way that these better players and high-end players are, are storing energy for impact is that they keep this hand path wide on the downswing and it creates this kind of circular shape or almost like a seashell. And everybody's is a little bit different, um, but the high-end players tend to have this roundish seashell looking hand path all the way on the downswing. And at impact here, they, they make that hand path curve more up and in. As I rotate this, you can see it curve more up and in, and that transfers energy out to the golf club. So instead of pulling straight down toward the ball, if you can feel like you keep a widish uh, hand path all the way down till about in this kind of waist high area then you start bending it up and in and a lot of that happens on its own with straightening of the legs and extending the body but just the idea that you're not pulling the grip straight toward the ball and you are keeping this kind of wide rounded shape to the hand path is going to really improve the way you strike the ball you're going to take um, more shallow divots with the irons and you'll finally maybe be able to hit up on the driver a little bit to improve your launch conditions, but uh, in general, we'll turn it a little bit different so you can see it a different way. Most players absolutely think they need to pull a grip toward the ball, and you can see here how nice and shape, round shape that is. Then he bends it up and in, transferring the energy to the club, and then the ball's on its way to the target. So, hope that helps. That's just a quick little uh, video today of hand path from face on. I know these images uh, help my game and have helped some of my students. I hope they help you also. If you have any questions or something that you'd like me to cover in the swing, leave it in the comments below and I'd be glad to do that for you. So we will see you in the next video.